You mustn't go! I'm going to save this girl. Taro Namatame. It's definitely him. Then he did come in here. So you're the killer! Let go of her! Ah, uh, <laughs> you're the ones I saved. Don't worry, I'll save this girl too. Huh? Does this dude hide or something? Quit talking shit and let go of the girl! Don't... don't come near me! <gasps> Nanako-chan! Calm down, Kanji-kun. We can't predict his behavior. We have to keep him talking. If we can discern his intentions, perhaps we can somehow deal with him. To save them. People needing to be saved appear. That's why I put them in the TV. No. We must pull his attention away from Nanako-chan. You put the people you saw on the Midnight Channel into this world, am I correct? They all want to be saved. Did I ever ask you to save me? You didn't save us, damn it! It was the exact opposite! If I hadn't put you in the TV, how would you have ended up... How would we? Are you trying to say we wouldn't have been able to face ourselves? What? But we nearly died! Yes. Exactly. You kidnapped them. Yes or no? Yes. Why did you target local residents who became known through the media? Why do these people appear on the Midnight Channel? On rainy nights, on TV, they signal me to save them. You keep saying save this and save that. Are you seeing murdering people as your idea of saving them? Murder? No. I'm saving them. How's that different, huh? All you're doing is killing people! <laughs> If you want to think that, go ahead. I know. You chased us all the way here to kill. <laughs> well, too bad. I'm gonna save her. <laughs> you asshole! You're not gonna get away with this! Shut the hell up! <laughs> what a wonderful world! An unknown, unreachable place filled with pleasant fog. I'm a savior! It's filthy over there. So many evildoers. That's why I'm going to save them! I'm a savior! A righteous hero! Is that... a shadow?
something. This could be bad. His powers are attracting more and more shadows to him. You guys got any suggestions? Look at him. He's merging with the shadows. Welcome back to Let's Play Persona 4. Naka, could you do me a quick favor and find out what the recommended level for this fight is? It is... 60 to 65. Yeah. I'm 81. I did not want this guy to, to not feel my rage for this whole thing. And say hello to the trumpeter. Oh, he's not the only one you'll see here that you're gonna love. It's just gonna keep getting better and better. This and I've got a special surprise for you for this one. This fight is not going to end super well, is it? No. <laughs> it is not gonna end well for him. I like how the face even looks a little bit like Namatame. Mm. I mean, it's obviously distorted, but it re it resembles him. I like it. If you're ever wondering what the most people kind of call this boss the uh, <laughs> the hippie Jesus. Yeah. Just because of the look of it, but it's mostly because of the fact that he believes himself to be a savior, and that's why mm. he looks like that. Here's the surprise I had for you that I didn't f figure would happen. What ho, Naka? Could you cast a quick spell for us? I cast Fist! <laughs> Big Fist. That's only gonna get better from here on out. Uh-huh. Look at that. Rory took it off like, what, a fourth of his <laughs> HP? In two turns? <laughs> yeah. Normally, the boss fights are hard if you stay within the recommended level. And that's why we're saying it's usually tough if you stay within the recommended level. Yeah, and I did you, not do that. And if you over-level, you can over-level a little bit, get up to like 71 or something, and you'll still be... I mean, you'll still be alright, and it gets hard to level up past that. But that's where... That's where our good friend over here went above and beyond and said, yeah, you know what? We're kind of not supposed to level up past this, and it's kind of really hard to, but, um... I did it anyway. We're doing it anyway. I'd say the one thing that I'm most confused about here is... Save her. I'm going to save her! Ah, uh, quad convergence. It essentially makes it to where only one, uh, one uh, element works on him. Hmm. Luckily, that's why I have this persona on me. So I can try to figure out what, what element it is. Almighty. No, that's a little too much for this fight. <laughs> uh, let's go with Zeodyne since everybody else has got one. It's Zeodyne it is. Uh, I guess it's electricity. Because we'll watch it. 
since electricity is the only one it is, everything else barely does anything. Except for this. This will do a lot. <laughs> well, this is kind of almighty, isn't it? It's physical. Physical. And that's pretty much yeah. the only... You know what? I can see that. That's pretty much the major reason everyone likes Chie over Kanji, is that she gets that big one. Yeah, the one thing that I'm most confu that I'm most unsure about with this boss is that we saw Namatame become his own shadow, and th I think that's where I'm a little bit confused. Is to become your own shadow? <laughs> He's already halfway dead. Are more effective now. Well, oh, actually... what's that? Electric attacks are more effective. I got a special one for this. Oh joy. Dang it. <laughs> I ruined the whole thing. On you. Out of all the things that have to happen, it has to miss there. <laughs> well, we we try. What were you gonna say? I was gonna say that um actually now that I think about it, maybe it does make some kind of sense. Because the whole reason you become your own shadow, much Look at that. like He's halfway uh, dead. <laughs> much like um our friend in Void Quest, Matsu. Yeah. So Mitsuo. Mitsu Mitsuo. Matsu. Freaking G U. Yeah. Mitsuo. Um, like him is because your shadow is. Not necess- I, I want to see your shadow isn't necessarily the part that you deny, but it's the part of you that... It's like the bad side of you that maybe shouldn't come out. I want to hurry, he's almost dead. And, um, like with Mitsuo, it's that he denied it so hard, but it wasn't because he denied it that he became his own shadow, it's that... He was showing the attributes of his shadow so much that the shadow ceased to be his shadow and instead became what he is main. And that's why he became a shadow. So I can actually see this making sense in that regard because Namatame was... And by this we can kind of guess what his shadow was. Take this! But it's that he just pushed that so hard that any other part of him ceased to be. So his shadow, the shadow part of him was the only part left. Here it comes. Don't give in. Please get back. That didn't get end well. At different parts of the battle. Like, a while back, he would have taken control of only one character, but once he gets down to this low, he takes control of your entire party. And they're under his control for a while, so... Um... That gonna work out for you there? I mean, the it'll boss be isn't a threat to us, but... Oh, it'll be fine. I keep the trumpeter on, will pretty much reflect or absorb almost all their elements. And sometimes they'll actually hesitate. Error. Takes about 25 HP. Unfortunately, we won't do anything to that one. But we dodged anyway. Because we're just awesome that oh. way. He flipped at us. Can't even target anyone else, so just be happy for that. Oh, one. I was kind of hoping you'd change back to the other one. Uh huh. You can even notice they have a little thing over their heads. Yeah, that's the little um. That's the peace symbol. Oh yeah, they do. I was just gonna say the particles were, um looked like the. I want to say berserk. Everyone broke free. I want to say berserk particles. So the rage. Thing. The rage particles, yeah. There we go. Yes. 
There we go. And it's because Dojima's with us, and that's the ultimate persona of the hero Font Arcana. And half the reason you wanted to get this high level. Oh, uh, yeah. It was for that. This is probably amplified here. Yep. Normally, pretty tough boss. But I smoked his ass because he took Nanako from us. And you don't fudge with Nanako. You do not fuck with a man's family. Oh, and of course she levels up. Damn it! Why? Nanako-chan! She looks like she's in pain, but she doesn't seem to be injured anywhere. This place must not be good for her. We need to carry her out, quick! We should take him with us as well. Yeah, we can't just leave him here, I guess. Nanako-chan, hang in there. <laughs> gonna do she's so small and she was stuck in there for so long and then there was that weird fog damn it the police and paramedics will be here shortly Nanachan still small, so her other self didn't appear like everyone else. And she got caught in all that craziness. I hope she'll be okay. I mean, are the doctors going to be able to help her? <laughs> I'm worried about Nanachan. But there's nothing more we can do for her. A delivery man named Namatame. The possibility of Nanako-chan being targeted. If only I'd been more thorough in putting the facts together. Then Nanako-chan wouldn't have had to go through this. That goes for me too. If I hadn't stood there like a lump in front of that bastard, Nanako-chan might have been okay. I hate myself. Why do I always panic when it matters most? I couldn't do anything either. I should have noticed sooner that something was wrong with that guy. Why did I waste time listening to what Namatame had to say? If I hadn't tried to engage him in conversation, and we'd rescued Nanako-chan immediately, this wouldn't have happened. But I still... All right. Enough of this pity party. Is standing around and whining really what we ought to be doing now? Feeling pathetic, consoling each other? That gonna solve anything? We gotta believe in her. So stop rehashing what's already done. Get it together, Naoto! Sorry. You're absolutely right. This is all that bastard Namatame's fault. And he's behind bars now, right? And it ain't like we were too late for Nanako-chan. Yeah, that's true. I'll come see Nanachan every day so she'll get better faster. That's all we can do right now. Gee, Kanji. You sounded cool for a second there. Huh? You guys still here? Adachi-san, um... 
Did they find out anything? Dojima-san speaking with the doctor now, but they can't say anything definite until they run some tests on her. Not just Nanako-chan, but the perp too. Who knows when we'll be able to hear his story. Well, it's getting late, so hurry home. The last thing we need is for you guys to collapse too. He's right. We should call it a night. Nanako-chan's gonna be fine. Acting all gloomy won't help anything. When Nanako-chan's out of the hospital, what should we do to celebrate? Dude, isn't it a little early for that? Why don't we reserve Juness and have a party there? A party at Juness? Uh, that makes no sense. Nanachan. She'll get better, right? Yeah, I do believe in her. Let's all have fun with Nanachan when she comes back. Thanks. I almost forgot how to keep a happy face. But with that out of the way, I'm feeling all hungry. <laughs> hey! Where did everyone go? Don't leave without me! The TV world is hard on anybody that goes into it. Uh, it was hard on us when we first went in. So for someone like Nanako to go in and spend that much time in without Good something day. like the glasses we have, just have to believe she's going to be all right. And we are actually accepting this invitation. Thank you. There's nothing we can do, so let's do what we can to get back to the status quo. To at least get back to some normalcy. Take our mind off things. Okay, this should be the rank six, six to, seven. to seven. cliche. <laughs> They're one and the same. I get it now. <laughs> Another challenge? Jury to not rest, or route for fable, minus 40, minus 4? Was that route? Um, I'm assuming that's how it's pronounced. This is like route without the E. Yeah. Or it's a weird way to s- a weird- Yeah, that, weird that, way that's to just a weird- root. that's just a weird word. Or it's a it's a weird way to spell root. I don't know, maybe an old-timey way. It does look kind of old-timey. 
said minus 40 minus 4. Well, that's like negative 44. <laughs> Um, subtract 40 and 4. Is that the answer? Yep. The correct one? Yep. The one we should be going for? Yes. I will poke you. I'm telling you the answer! I have to find some way to be cheery after all that. I don't get it. Oh, you subtract the words. Or that, I don't know. Oh, well, that's silly. June has table. And that's the Phantom why. Thief knows where our hideout is. Let's go. And that's why I'm not a detective. We'd be in Africa right now. Yep, I got another. But it was all in Japan. Why are we in Africa? I always wanted to come here. I don't know. It sounded like they wanted me to go to Africa in that last message. <laughs> oh god, what horrible invention do we have this time? First we had that badge that does, does nothing, then we had a wristwatch that blinds people by telling them what time it is. Nifty. <laughs> you could throw it in their eyes. Ah! Why would you do that? It's effective as a throwing weapon if you're really good at throwing pens. <laughs> Don't be afraid. <laughs> I have to say, I really like all the female characters in this game. They yeah. just do them so well. Hmm. Nauto, especially. Yeah. A lot of people give Nauto a lot of crap for how she's portrayed, but I think it was portrayed really well. I mean, for the most part, when I see people complaining about how it was portrayed, they don't really quite understand what they were going for. Opening her heart towards us. Ranku up! Ranku up, Ranku up. Inaba. I can't do that, do that. Inaba. There we go. Okay, now we're all caught up on what we missed. Y'all happy? Guys can't let a scene play itself out naturally without me throwing in a running joke. Poor plebeians. By smacking them out of you. Actually, she probably just shoots them out of you. <laughs> ah! Well, I don't have cancer anymore. <laughs> I'll see you again. Pretty sure all my cancer is plastered against the wall behind me now. <laughs> oh, nobody's here to greet day. us. Well, at least for the moment, this may be something we have to get used to, but we just have to have confidence. She'll be all right. This is the first chance that we get to properly save after all the events. So, until next time, everyone. <laughs>